This is gonna be a lot, but I'm gonna try my best to explain how Shenna's Icy Quills work. Her Quill Damage Bonus scales off of her current or total attack, which includes her base attack, external buffs, weapon, and artifacts. When you use her skill, Shenha gives each of your party members 5 quills that last for 10 seconds if it was pressed, and 7 quills that last for 15 seconds if it was held. The only way these quills can be used is if a character deals cryo damage, and each instance of cryo damage will use 1 quill. So if you have 3 enemies and you hit them all once each for 3 cryo damage instances, it would consume 3 quills. This is why the number of enemies and also the speed that a character deals cryo damage will change how fast quills are consumed. Something I wanted to note was if you look at Calamity Queller here, after using a skill it increases Shenha's attack over time, and the damage bonus of the quill depends on what Shenha's attack is at the moment that the quill was shot. So there are ways to increase her damage bonus from quills. Uh, just like if you stood on Bennett's circle after using her skill. Now the real power of her skill lies in the fact that its total damage depends on the stats of the character who's dealing it, uh, who has the quill. So if we take a quick look at the damage formula, damage is usually the base damage multiplier multiplied by damage bonus and then multiplied again by crit damage. There's a lot more going on like damage reduction from enemy defense, special multipliers and reactions, but for simplicity's sake, <laughs> let's stick with this. Where the quills come into play is they're added as flat damage um, on top of the base damage and then they're multiplied by damage bonus and then crit damage. This is why Shenha synergizes really well with cryo teammates that have high crit damage and lots of damage bonuses and characters like Kazuha really help amplify them by providing more damage bonus. This is not even considering Shenha's own damage bonus res reduction. Um, and the team you're seeing on screen right now takes full advantage of her kit because every single one of them can consume her quills. So really quickly, let's take a look at Ganyu and how much icy quills can amplify her damage. We got her on Amos's bow, a lot of damage bonus from the weapon, crit damage, cryo damage bonus. Even if the multiplier for her Frostflake, Arrow, and Bloom are different, it won't change the damage that the Icy Quill does because it's just dependent on Ganyu's damage bonus and crit damage. So right now we can see it's doing 12k, 24k after holding a skill. It can go up to 20k, 33k, it's about an 8k Quill damage. Um, and you get 7 shots when you hold. It's worth noting also that when you hold, it gives a 15% charge normal attack damage bonus too, so that also helps. Um, now we add Kazuha's buff and we're doing over 105k per complete volley, <laughs> so you can really see how it all stacks up with all the damage bonuses and res decreases. Shenha's absolute best teammate that synergizes the best with her is Ayaka. Miss Splitter gives a lot of damage per cent. She can also hold for Blizzard Strayer and usually played in freeze comps. Her C6, something that I just wanted to show, um, gives her an insane damage bonus on her charge attacks, which hit three times, which means it consumes a minimum of three quills. It can hit multiple targets as well. Um, even if you don't have C6, this comboed with Shenha's hold skill does a ton of damage, but um, it just shows how much more you can push and has quills the more you invest in certain characters. So 20k raw damage roughly if you just add a hold skill, add on the quills, um, you're getting a huge increase to 48k, which is pretty good. And now we can add Kazuha's swirl um, to get the VV res shred and his damage bonus. And we'll see Ayaka's charge attack go up to 72k each time, <laughs> each hit. So that's pretty good. Kind of just shows you how far you can push your Shenna's quills. This isn't even using bursts or thrilling tails or anything. So just so you get a rough idea. This is my Shenna's build. She's C1 with Calamity Queller on 4 Peace Noblesse. I hope you found this video informative. 
I know it was a lot to take in, but thank you for watching to the end.